Welcome back to Chal Sidekar. In this, we're going to do the speed test and the RAM management test comparison between the Realme GT versus the OnePlus Nord 2 device. And during this time, I'll try to use the high performance mode in the OnePlus Nord 2 and GT mode in the Realme GT device. So, in this video, I'm going to include the five big games: Asphalt 9. Battery One's mobile game, Call of Duty, FIFA, and the Genshin Impact. Five games I did include. Let's see which phone can actually open these games faster. So this is the test which I'm trying to do after the recent software updates, which is a September security uh, patch update, which the both phones did receive. Let's see which phone gonna have what kind of uh, testing results. That's what I'm going to exactly demonstrate in this video. All the apps are completely clean from the background. You can clearly see that. And I need to connect to the same kind of Wi-Fi network as well because that's also main uh, important thing. So both phones are connected to the same 2.4 gigahertz exactly same network. Now everything is completely clean from the background as well. Now let's start. Let me need to open. Start with the GT mode. GT mode is turned on, and uh, high performance mode in the OnePlus is also turned on. Yes, clearly see high performance mode is turned on. So both phones are completely kind of equal. Let's start with the first game, which is a Asphalt 9 game. One, two, and three. Let's see how much difference can it be there between these both phones in terms of the opening speeds. So this, this is going to be really very interesting as I said. So these are the five big games I did select. So Snapdragon 88 processor versus the Diamond Chip 1200 chipset and 8GB RAM versus 8GB RAM variant. Nothing much huge difference regarding the RAMs. Wow, both phones were able to open exactly the same. It's same pace. Now Diamond Chip 1200 in this OnePlus Nord 2 exactly. Not bad. So in terms of the opening speeds, you can see OnePlus Nord 2 again was slightly faster than the Realme GT, little bit. And uh, let's see, both phones are updating at this moment and at same pace. Both phones are loading and this phone is supposed to load but it's not loading my account. So no problem, I'll try to start this Badrion's mobile game test once again. Because it took some time for my account to load in the Realme GT, that's the reason. Let me need to close it. And yep, let's start again, one, two, three, yep. So now it should be kind of fair test because nothing to update at this moment so in case if you want me to compare any other uh, phones in this way let me know in the conversation below what phones you want me to compare so this is a question which has been requested by a few of my users with using high performance mode versus gt mode you can see the oneplus not was able to open slightly faster the badwins mobile game the damage to 1200 in, in this phone yes not bad in terms of the opening speeds so let's see the Call of Duty game. What happens to this game Call of Duty? So this is going to be really very interesting to see. And both phones are loading with the accounts. You can clearly see there. Not bad. I think the first Realme GT did open a little bit faster than the OnePlus Nord 2. Just a little bit. Not a huge difference. And let's move to the next game which is a FIFA game. So in the FIFA game, I think both phones were able to maintain exactly same. Not uh, much huge difference in the FIFA game. First is the Realme GT and then the OnePlus Nord 2 did open this. Yes, first the Realme GT did open a little bit, not bad. Even the OnePlus Nord 2 was able to come very close to the Realme GT as well. So if you try to use the high performance mode in the OnePlus Nord 2, only then it was able to perform really good. Only in the high performance mode. If you disable the high performance mode, it doesn't uh, perform like this, no. So the image was able to show the login first and then the OnePlus Nord 2. And I did tap at same time in both phones. Let's see the loading speeds. So which will enter the world first. And then I'll try to check the RAM management. So which phone has got what type of RAM management. So both phones tap to open. Now we'll be able to get to know the answers. What is happening between these both devices. In terms of the opening speeds. And right now, OnePlus Nord 2 did open the Genshin Impact game first, then the Realme GT. Wow. So, overall, friends, in that speed test, the OnePlus Nord 2 has got slight advantage. I mean, little bit, only using the high performance mode, it has got some advantage. Now, let's see the RAM management, how it is in terms of the managing five games. Can it open all the five games in the background? RAM management or not? That's kind of a question mark at this moment. But let's see let's do our best call of duty so three games should not be any kind of issues between these both phones so three games absolutely kind of fine let's check the bad mobile game one two and three so bad mobile game got close in the one place not two but it was 
there in the background time management the realme gt that's another one advantage let's see the asphalt 9 game Asphalt 9 came in both phones it got close little bit but realme gt has got a little bit advantage in the ram management but in the speed test the oneplus not 2 did come very close to the realme gt in terms of the speed test so that's it friends thank you for watching this video this is a quick comparison between both phones in case if you have any other queries let me know in the conversation below meanwhile signing off bye